Hello InfoBuddies, welcome back. This is InfoBlitz101. So most of you here that watch my videos are asking me some certain problems connecting to the HDMI video capture card. So if you're using the HDMI video capture card like this one or the smaller ones that I've already shown you my videos here on my channel and most of you here are asking me that you're experiencing colored line screens like this one. So that one. So if you're using a camcorder camera or cell phone and you're trying to connect it to this device and you're experiencing that type of situation that you're having those types of signals on your screen so stay tuned because i'm going to be showing you on how to fix that problem so let's go everybody's here we are as you can see on my monitor here that it has a colored line signal meaning it doesn't have any signal with the main uh, console itself so I have here on the side is the Nintendo Switch console and uh, also I'm using the HDMI video capture card so some of you will experience that there will be some like this one it has colored signal lines so what is the main cause of having this type of signal line the main cause of this signal line is the connection between the main console itself so it means that the main console isn't connected well to the monitor itself uh, especially when on the video capture card so most of you will say that oh it doesn't work well it works but there's something that you have to know in order for you to plug or the connection is not just in the proper way so i'm going to teach you how to fix this an easy way so this is just an easy way for those who are just new and uh wants to know about how to fix these uh color lines uh signal meaning that it doesn't connect with the main console itself so let's go and check out on the different things that you have to know on connecting the device okay so okay let's go and check on the different things that you have to know first of all the signal from the main console itself see as my nintendo switch is already on and ready to be played but as you can see here in my monitor on my laptop it still represents a, a colored signal meaning it's not connected so what are the things that we have to know for us to check first of all unplug everything so check if the cable from the connection is okay so so you also have to check the plugs of the USB if there are some damages also the main cable itself check the damages or anything that might be broken on the cable so there's no problem with this so I'll just have to put it back so secondly check your HDMI video capture card if it has any damages dents or whatever so my video capture card is okay so I don't see any damages or any kind of dents or scratches from this device so and also check your HDMI video capture card that is connected to your Nintendo switch still the cable is okay so there's no problem with the cable from the hdmi video capture card so you have to put this on the input slot if you're just gonna use a single monitor like the laptop or the monitor of your computer so plug it in and put the usb cable connected to the laptop here so you already checked it and uh, still there is no signal all right okay so so I'll just have to put the HDMI video capture card there within the Nintendo switch you can see it's active so it's active guys so meaning there is no problem with the unit so check the cables that are connected within the Nintendo switch so the plugs are mainly okay 
so they are plugged properly and secured so what is the main problem so still it doesn't have any you know signal what we're going to do is we're going to remove you can see here it's already put on the video capture device so remove the video capture device and we're going to restart a new addition to a device on the OBS studio so let's go to remove so let's remove this yes so you can see now that the OBS studio hasn't have any device that are added to it right now so let's go to the plus symbol here look for video capture device so okay you can see that there is a the option of video capture device press ok so you can see there you go so there it is so you can only use the usb video capture card and there you go so in order for you to fit the screen just transform and fit the screen and there you go guys that is how you fix the colored line signal that you're always having problems with the different types of hdmi video capture card so in order for you to fix it so just do what i do and make sure that your cables and uh, connections of the cables are properly attached so that there that so that there will be no problems at all for you to connect the transmission of the main console itself to the hdmi and also the monitor itself so there you go so that's about it for our video for today i do hope it helped you a lot so if you're just new to the channel please do subscribe and also put a like on the video and i'll be seeing you soon make your own perspective guys this is infoblitz 101 saying make your own perspective Bye bye